What's up guys, welcome back to Tech Phantom. And in this video, we are going to talk about the Samsung Galaxy S22 and the S22 Plus and about its major upgrades in the camera department. So if you are new here, then consider subscribing to our channel, Tech Phantom, and also hit that bell icon so you never miss an update from us. Help us reaching out as our 1000 subscribers goal. So let's get started. So as you guys all know that the Samsung Galaxy S21 series was the minor upgrade over the Samsung Galaxy S20 and the S20 Plus. Now in terms of the camera department, the S21 will deliver the decent camera upgrades over the S20 but the S22 will be having a major upgrade over the cameras. As there is a change in pattern for the cameras from the tipster fronton who I'll who has allegedly said that the S22 and the S22 Plus will feature a 50 megapixel main sensor from the 12 megapixel. Also, the ultra wide camera will be of 12 megapixel ultra wide shooter and a 12 megapixel of 3x telephoto sensor. Now, if you're wondering that how that the Samsung Galaxy S22 series is being relatable to this and how the rainbow come into the picture. Now let me take to your previous tweet by the same tipster where he has revealed that the Samsung Galaxy S22 series will be called a rainbow and the models will be using with the names of a colors. For instance that the Samsung standard Galaxy S22 is used while for the and the S22 plus is being used for the blue. For the ultra version it's deriving from that we can surely import a dimension for the rainbow and it, not only that if we talk about that the same whether the 50 megapixel is the right move or the wrong let's assume that the extra resolution will give a better camera and not only in that case the samsung will switch to a 50 megapixels primary sensor which might be the right step forward for the future galaxy flagships now i'm saying this because that the 50 megapixel would be a better option opinion and it will be a isocell gn2 which will offer smaller pixels than the 12 megapixel on the main camera which has been used on the base and the plus model not only that but the generation second for this will be able to outputting the pixel binded shots compared to the 12.5 megapixel and 2.8 macro camera now if we talk about the present models uh, and put it alongside then the alongside the S22 then there is also will allow an 8K recording which will be able to deliver the 8K video recording for a better low light videography. Now in, the in terms of at least in the theories that the S21 and the S21 plus given that the GM2 sensor has a larger pixels which means that the more light can opportunity can come and give out the overall better quality for the phone which means that the vanilla galaxy variant will miss out on the periscope cameras for the another one year two and it will be made remain to the ultra model that is the samsung galaxy s22 ultra in your thoughts in the comment section below and i'll see you in the very next one thanks for watching